time. Who says it's quitting time? I said it's quitting time. I's the foreman. I's the one says when it's quitting time at Tara. Quitting time. Quitting time. <laughs> to them low-down, poor, white, trash, slatterly, instead of being here eating our supper. Cookie, stuff the power of myself at home. Say, I don't got no business wearing herself out. Cook? Yes, ma'am. Take the lamp out on the porch. Wearing herself out. Mr. Jeff, Miss Ellen's home. Wearing herself out waiting for the poor, white, trash. Get up, dog. Bobbing in the house like that. Get up from there, boy. Don't you hear Miss Ellen coming? Get out there and get her medicine, chin. When we was getting worried about you, Miss Ellen, Mr. Jeff. All right, Jeff. I'm home. Mrs. O'Hara, we finished plowing the creek bottom today. What do you want me to start on tomorrow? Mr. Wilkerson, I've just come from Emmy Slattery's bedside. Your child has been born. My child, ma'am? I'm sure I don't understand. Has been born and mercifully has died. Good night, Mr. Wilkerson. Now fix your supper for you myself and you eat it. It's after prayers. Yes, sir. O'Hara, you must dismiss Jonas Wilkerson. Dismiss him, Mrs. O'Hara? He's the best overseer in the county. And he must go tomorrow morning the first thing. But I... No. <laughs> the Yankee Wilkerson and the white trash slattery girl? Now, we'll discuss it later, Mr. O'Hara. Yes, Mr. O'Hara. Oh, no. Who? Just hold on and suck in. Mammy, here's for Scarlet Bickle. You can take it all back to the kitchen. I won't need to buy it. Oh, yes, and you is. You was going to eat every mouthful of this. Oh, I know. You put on the dress, because we're late already. What my lamb going to wear? That. No, you ain't. You can't show your bosom for three o'clock. I'm going to speak to your ma about you. If you say one word to mother, I won't need to buy it. Well... Keep the shawl on your shoulder. I ain't even free to get all freckled after the buttermilk I done put on you all this winter. Reaching them circles. <laughs> oh, now, Miss Scarlet, you come on and be good and eat just a little, No. Honey. I'm going to have a good time today. Do my eating at the barbecue. If you don't care what folks says about this family, I does. I has told you and told you that she can always tell a lady but the way that she eats in front of folks like a bird. And I ain't aiming for you to go to Mr. John Wilkerson's and eat like a field hand and gobble like a hog. Fiddle dee dee. Ashley Wilkes told me he likes to see a girl with a healthy appetite. What gentlemen says and what they think is two different things. And I ain't noticed Mr. Ashley asking for to marry you. Sick. That's all, Miss Scarlet. Your pa. He just wild when they wouldn't let him fight on kind of his broken knee. And he had fits when they took all us field hands to dig the ditch for the white soldiers to hide in. But your ma said the Confederates needs it. So we's going to dig for the south. Sam, was there a doctor? Sorry, ma'am. We've got to march. Goodbye, Miss Scarlet. Don't worry. We'll stop them Yankees. Goodbye, Big Sam. Goodbye, boy. If any of you get sick or hurt, let me know. Goodbye, Miss Scarlet. Goodbye. 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 Oh, 
Maggie, this is no day for walking. You'll get run over. Oh, Rhett. Rhett, drive me to Aunt Kitty's, please.